हाँ तो उसको जिसको मैं करो सिक्सटी डेस्ट टोल चला आज ही मैं अंडर थर्टी एट आरोप सिक्सटी तो चलो वही मैं सिमिलर स्टोन है वॉइस करूँगा और पीपर हुआ हुआ है बाई से मेट्टी यार खाया हुआ है माइनर सा और बॉडी का भी भयंकर लेवल का स्टोन है सबको पता होगा फीवर वैसे क्या होता है फर्स्ट ईयर में करूँगा ये चैलेंज इतना भयंकर स्टोन उठाने की कोशिश करूँगा देखते कर पाता हूँ इन्हें अभी भले मेरा तबीयत खराब है और फर्स्ट स्क्रीन में यह पता है इसने क्या लगाया खुद में कि भी मेरे को वर्ल्ड स्ट्रॉगेस्ट मेरे में मौका मिल गया मेरा तबीयत बहुत खराब है तो मैं इतना बड़ा मौका थोड़ा ना छोड़ूंगा जितना हो सके भले मर जाओ बट स्टिल मैं अटैम्प लूँगा ना वही सिमिलर जगह मैं खुद को मैं रखाऊँ ठीक 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 तो अटैम्प लूँगा भले कुछ भी हो जाए चलो देता हूँ अटैम्प कितना अटैम्प दे सकते हो देखता हूँ चलो
I'm really happy today, you know. I need more few days, and I think I will be able to lift it this much. Today I've already lifted it by this much. I'm really happy to be honest. And the thing is that I, I for a moment I thought that I, I tore my hips, you know, my hips. I thought I broke them. The amount of pain, as you have guys, I've suddenly left that weight. Actually, it, it got slipped from my hand due to which the sudden shock caused this nasty amount of pain and i was having fever i was i was expecting zero i thought that i won't be able to lift it today no but the best i've lifted it so far this what really shows that how much human body is capable of you know and you all just should never give up i was having fever i was having zero chances of lifting it and due to overtraining my whole body is aching so hard my each and every bones were begging me for mercy but as you guys know i'm doing city days stone prison so i can't give them rest and i could have lifted another stone but as you have guys i've already said that i won't be touching in another stone underneath until and unless i lift this so i've kept my promises the best i've lifted till date i'm really feeling really happy i just can't explain the happiness you know i know you all guys believing me at the at the first day i've already guys i've told you guys that i'm god's child for a reason and today i don't have to prove anything you know i was having fever but still how i managed to pull this weight the best way i have zero idea bro there is something i got something i'm just something power you know i got something supernatural power i think you know i can be this i can be this real life superman i'm currently 60 kgs i don't know what the weight will be of this stone i'll be measuring it in the near future if i able to get to 2500 rupees I will earn that money and after that I will be purchasing that weighing machine let's see how long that takes and my parents are saying me that you should go and join the gym and compete in a powerlifting or else weightlifting competition weightlifting is going to be totally new for me but the powerlifting uh, I know I will be able to do good so I'll be joining a gym after, I will be joining the gym after 60 days you know let this challenge get completed but still i was sticking to the stone lifting that's the only thing which has taught me who i really am describes me and it shows that the never give a mentality of mine so if my goal was to get a build a home gym of my own but at this point moment having zero money let's see how long that takes you know the the thing is that you'll be able to use your full potential only when you have got that that thing of your own after that you'll be able to use it how much you want now i mean you can abuse that which you can abuse that weight you can drop it from here you can toss it above the sky doesn't matter but when it comes to the gym you won't be able to do that even if you drop the weight a little bit from this much to the ground and and i lift really heavy race weight due to which the grounds really shake and the trainer complains that mm, don't bang the weight but the real deal is i don't even bang the weight i keep them even slowly but still it makes the sound i'm really strong so what should i do man you know the all of most of the gyms fears me and i don't like to go to them but only there's only one gym which i like to go to them is the hammer strength that all the prs most of my last year prs were done in that gym so i would like to talk to you guys about more of my life after a while i'll be drinking water so that we're talking i would like to talk with you guys more i think it's enough for today because i've already done my best i would have given more attempts if i wasn't dealing with the fever but the thing is my poor body is totally fucked up you know right now and i don't want to get blacked out and i'm getting a nasty headache let's see i won't be dying so soon bro i'm i'm born in this world for something reason you know I'm going to be the next Gamma Pel one, I guess so. I'm currently weighing in 60 kgs. Gamma Pel one was 410 kgs. And if I touch 110 kgs and my current height is 5'4, that is going to be insane, you know. But let's hope for the best. I don't want to hope on any sort of PEDs. I'm totally natural. Natural, I mean, super, I'm super natural. I don't even eat protein, you know. I don't, I can't afford protein supplements due to which I eat chicken. But these days, my uh, meals are totally worse. But still, I'm making progress. That basically shows how mad you can get for a single thing. If you want something, you should go for it. If you are a real man, you know.
just keep the faith in God and you're gonna make it. Doesn't matter how tough the situation come, but you must keep hundred percent believe in God. You know, hundred percent. And you know what I believe. If you are strong, try your best to stay humble and give respect to every individual. And if someone is there who is weaker than you, you should you should not even you know show your power to them. If you are if you really want to show your show cast your power, go with someone who is two to three times more powerful than you. I believe in this way you will be able to get humble and be able to get more and more techniques and you got to you are going to get learn many many things from this. And the real deal is believe in God. Keep your hundred percent faith in God, and everything will be okay. Stay okay. No sort of injury is going to. Do any sort of harm to you, you know. And you no, know, you should love the nature. The way I'm love, I love the stones. I love the land. I'm currently sitting over here, you know, the place where I used to live. Stone. You will get to learn many, many things once you get connected to the nature. It is going to tell you many secrets. How you can get strong. You are you will get able to get learn many many things. That's the only reason I believe you should believe in God. And two of the birds are. Uh, yeah, you can see these two birds. They are marrying me. They are listening to my words. What I'm saying. You can clearly see them. They are looking at me. To be honest, I was really. Weak today, but I don't know how I managed to pull this weight. It's incredible, bro! It's incredible. It's insane. It doesn't matter how tough the situation comes, what sort of disease, what sort of thing you are dealing with, just go for the thing which you want, you know. And it should not harm any other human. You can do whatsoever you want, but it should not harm anyone. So that was it for today. Hope you guys like my video. See you again. Bye bye. Day thirty seven out of sixty.